How to properly bake high poly when there are holes, but not in low poly. Sometimes, situations may come when we will have high poly with holes like this one, and the low poly is completely flat without any holes. Let's see what will happen when we bake this. In the baking mode, I will load the high poly. Let's put the resolution to 4K. And don't forget to match the mesh by mesh name. We don't need ID. Let's bake this. Return to painting mode. Here, the holes from high poly made dark shadow type of shape. Down here the baking goes wrong. In most of the case, holes from high poly makes this kind of weird shapes instead of proper shape. We need to fix the high poly for this. We need to block the hole. I am making a box to fill the hole. Let's resize it and put it in the place. Fill all the remaining holes. Now, we need to attach all the boxes with high poly. Remember to match the high poly and low poly names. Let's export the high poly. I'm going to replace this. In Painter, let's reload the high poly. Bake it again. Now, this is the proper shape we would want from the baking. We need this because we don't have holes in low poly, and it would be easy to properly identify the shapes when properly baked. We could have used opacity map if it was a plane to make hole. This shape is made with box, meaning it have two layers stacked. So, opacity map will just mess the whole thing. If poly count won't be a problem, it is better to make holes in low poly too. Thanks for watching this video. Consider helping my channel by subscribing. If you have any problems, please let me know in the comments. Let's share and learn together.